To transfer Office to a new system, you'll first need to deactivate and uninstall it off of the first system. So let's go ahead and do that. First, let's scroll down to the link in the article. So first, we'll log into Microsoft Office. Click on this link here and log in. And click Sign In. And we'll immediately see that under the installs, we already have one. So if we click on the install, we can go to our machine and click deactivate install. And it'll ask us if we're sure, and we'll click deactivate. Now we'll need to uninstall it off of our computer. So let's click the start menu or press Windows X, and we'll go to our control panel and click uninstall a program. And let's navigate to our Office, and for me, I'm using Office 365. You might be using Office 2010 or Office 2013. And then we'll click Uninstall. It'll ask if we're ready, so click Uninstall again. And then it's going to remove it. And this process could take about five minutes. And then once it's done, we'll click Close, and then close out of our program and features. And then log on to your new system that you want to install it on. Log into your Microsoft account and click install. And then it'll download the setup file and just click on that and click run. It'll prompt you, just click yes. Then it'll start installing. And from here, it's just like the first time you installed it on your original system. Once it's done downloading, we'll go ahead and click next and skip over this uh, video presentation, we'll click Next. And then either sign in or say maybe later, we'll click on that and click Next. Say no thanks. And then in the background, it's going to finish installing and then you'll be ready to go. It'll pop up in your programs menu just like it did before. And that's how you transfer Office from an old system to a new system.